All right, here we go with today's daily challenge. I wasn't able to play last night with Emily, so we're trying to get around in this morning. Throwing all kinds of different lines on this hole. Come very close lots of times. This is one of the more complicated lines. There's easier ones for sure, but this is looking pretty good. Oh, just a bad skip there, but easy eagle. The ace is definitely doable, I'm sure. I think no Alf's got it, a few others have already got it, so. If you really want that, I think it's easier just to get the eagle and then the, and keep restarting until you get the ace on this hole. This is the warship. A little bit of Anheuser right in the middle. So I think that's the ideal way to start. If, if you wait for the ace on one, there's a good chance you'll miss it on two. So I don't think it's worth grinding unless you really want that ace. But I think one of these times I'm going to get it. Just by sheer chance. See if we can come really close on this one a few times. Oh, this is looking good. No, too much hyzer. Right on line. A little too much to the left. Kind of a fun layout. I wish I had more time to play it. Uh, more time to grind this one. We just got too much going on right now. This one I found a pretty decent line with the glide roll rive on a forehand. Middle, middle chevron just kind of pointed down to the basket and put, uh, I don't know, a disc of Anheuser to where they're not quite touching there. Oh, go in. Oh, come on. That's frustrating. That looked good. This one's a little tough with that wind. I just try to throw it right at it and hope I get a good skip and not a floppy skip, and you can usually end up within putting distance, but it's hard to get it very close with this wind. That worked out pretty well. Still always tough with that four wind, so you got to be careful on these putts. Don't ruin the round by getting in a hurry. So there's that eagle. This one, definitely gettable if you hit it just right. I've been throwing the glide skip, just middle chevron right on the basket, and then just kind of a little bit of hyzer to it. And this is looking really good. That's going to go in. Oh, that's two holes. I thought I had it. It's all right, though. I think the best round's 15, so you got to get an extra stroke in here somewhere. And I thought I had that twice now, but definitely need to get this one, too. This is it's risky. This is the frustrating one. I just cannot get consistent with this as far as skipping it over. It's probably better to go light glide and just carry it. But I thought I had, oh, this is looking perfect. Oh yeah. No, come on. Oh, there went the 14 under because that crappy skip. That was like, mm, that's so frustrating. Let's see if I can save birdie though. 105. All right, at least we saved birdie. Try to get around posted and make a video for you. But man, it's been a frustrating round so far. Maybe we can get one back here. I like the accurate roll sapphire here with the top chevron kind of just down on the basket, on the top of the basket. A little bit of hyzer, kind of the head of the unicorn there. Let's see how close we can get this. Stay right, stay right. Dang it. Well, could have been a really, really good round, but still respectable. As long as we don't screw anything up on these. Oof. Oh, like that was almost a nasty spit out. Too high in the chains. This one, not too long ago, I had a 15 under round going, and all I needed is, I was 14 going into this hole and I threw it in the water. I should probably go the other route, but, oh man, get up. But the first time I played this, I almost aced it with this line, so I've been sticking with it on this wind, but it's probably smarter to do the backhand route because I had an awesome round and then I threw it in the water. And all I needed to do was birdie and get 15 under, but that's all right. We got a round, 13 under, respectable. Definitely not the top. But that's the first time we finished it. If Emily was here, she'd be saying, check, 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 check. No new disc today. Or at least right now. And 
Looks like Yi and Annie Rook. Rook. Nice shooting, boys. Here we go with a little highlight. Got this earlier. Wanted to add it to the end of the video. Wasn't recording, but I got, that's my first time getting the Albion on this hole. And then I proceeded to throw it out of bounds on the next hole, of course. But hope you all enjoyed. For those of you still grinding, hope this helps out. There's some pretty good lines there. Definitely a chance to get an awesome round. So hopefully one of y'all do it. And appreciate y'all watching me play some BGV.